Hi, my name is Kim, and I get the honor of serving on the worship team here at Hope City. Today, we'll be praying for purity. Now, I know that I'm not the only one that hears the word purity and automatically thinks of abstaining from sex until marriage or all the holier than thou things that the world ascribes to that word. However, the more that I've studied God's word and the more that I've allowed the Holy Spirit to reveal His heart and will behind purity, I'm not as triggered by it. Most of the time in scripture, when we hear the word purity or pure, it's used in reference to the condition of the heart. In Matthew 5, verse eight, it says, "'Blessed are the pure in heart, for they will see God.'" And then also in Psalms 24, David says, "'Who will ascend the hill of the Lord, "'and who will stand in His holy place? "'Those with clean hands and pure hearts.'" See, I strongly believe that God is more concerned with the condition of our hearts than anything else. Purity involves a deep introspective look at the decisions we make and testing them against the standard of God's Word. So when we think and when we meditate on Jesus, because He is the standard of purity, we as believers hold ourselves accountable to. The Bible says that man looks at the outward appearance, but God, He looks at the heart. The heart points to all things. This is why we must guard it with much intention. The Bible also says to guard your heart because everything you do flows from it. So today, as we pray for ourselves, for our hearts and our family members, maybe those that are struggling with internal things and producing strange fruit, let's pray for compassion and not condemnation. Let's pray for the root and allow the Lord to work on the fruit because it is the Holy Spirit that leads us to all truth and shows us truly how to walk in purity. Let's pray. Father God, we thank you so much for being the example that we need for purity. We know that you are coming back for a pure bride with no blemishes, and we are a part of that promise. So I pray, Lord Jesus, that you would give us clean hands and pure hearts. Your Holy Spirit would guide us into knowing you, knowing what pleases you, what brings you grief, the things that you desire to see in us. I pray right now, Father God, that you would work on our insides and allow the Holy Spirit to do a new thing inside of us so that we can truly walk in purity. We love you, Lord. We trust you with this and we depend on you for all things. It's in Jesus' name we pray, amen.